Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 27th. So I'm just gonna see what comes up. I already did one. I'm sorry, this is so late, but you know, I just figured I'd do another one. So let's just see what we got. What do we have for around the 27th? We have the Four of Wands reversed. So this is party is over. It is cleanup time, right? This is a messy situation, right? The party's over. This is the end of a commitment, right? That somebody's not happy. This ain't the fun and game is done. Over. Nothing to celebrate here with that card. Page of Cups reversed. Now the Page of Cups reversed is bad news. Okay, somebody may be, there could be a rejection here. Somebody may be receiving some sad news. They may be in their emotions. Could be because there's an end of a commitment here. This is this could be the end of a commitment. Somebody definitely not happy, and they're they're in their emotions. There's there's obviously something emotional going on. Oh, another one. Five of Swords struggling. Somebody is struggling. They're struggling with their ego. Uh, yeah, there's some sort of battle going on. And I think that there could be an unrequited love situation, or there's tears, there's sadness. Uh, somebody's walking away. Somebody is walking away with that Five of Swords. They're, going, they're not going to fight anymore. They're walking away. Not gonna fight. They're sick of fighting. There's been there's been so too much too much pain, too much hurt, too much betrayal. You know, the five of swords is is a big huge power struggle, conflicts, fighting. You know, it's time to just walk away. It's heartbreaking. I mean, the page of cups in reverse. That's heartbreaking. Yeah, it's over. <laughs> it's over. It's it's over. Yeah, there's definitely going to be a rejection. Definitely. Somebody's somebody's going there's going to be a rejection. There's there's a one-sided situation here. We have somebody here that doesn't uh give. They don't have anything to offer. They they're not putting in what they're supposed to be putting in. You know, the Six of Pentacles reverse is somebody, you know, it could be somebody that is unemployed. You know, this is a fraud. This is, this is an abuse of power. Somebody is abusing their power. Or they have abused their power. And they haven't given what they were, what they were supposed to give. And now they're struggling. They're really, really, really struggling. They've been fighting something. There's definitely ego here. Somebody's been fighting. having a hard time doing the right thing because of ego wanting to win at all costs but the party's over the the battle i feel like the battle is over but they're still fighting so it feels like somebody's still fighting when it's already over Somebody's bubble is about to be burst. All their fighting and their ego and the, the fact that they don't have anything to offer. I mean, that six of coins reverse, that's nothing. I don't, that is nothing. Knight of coins reverse. Could be dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Could be dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Could be dealing with a, with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Um... Could also be dealing with a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Doesn't really matter. But this is somebody that is unqualified. Definitely. I feel like we have somebody here that doesn't have any money. They don't have any. They're not stable. They're not secure. This is lazy. There's no job. Somebody could be getting unemployed even or becoming unemployed. A, a lack of financial stability here. We have somebody here that is not financially stable or they're just not stable, period. You know, they're, they're insecure. They're lazy. This is a sponger. This is somebody also that could be very greedy, very selfish. We could even have theft here, you know. 
we definitely have somebody that is not qualified for a position. They're not. This is somebody that is irresponsible, lazy, doesn't keep a job or is unemployed or doesn't work very hard or, you know, they're just, they don't have any long-term plan. So we have somebody here that is not going to be receiving, uh, you know, something because they're just not qualified. So I feel like there's some bad news coming for somebody that isn't qualified. This is somebody that is in their ego. There could definitely be a rejection. It's like, you don't have anything to offer me. You don't have anything to offer. Why would I, why would I give it to you? I mean, the page of cups revert upright is an offer reverse. It's no. So I do think there's some sort of battle going on or some sort of fight or a power struggle. Obviously there's a change that is happening. Ten of Cups reverse. So yeah, this is this is like I don't know if there's children leaving or family dispute or the end of a relationship. I mean, the Ten of Cups reversed. Definitely some, you know, uh, emotional uh, disappointment here. This is I feel like we have a relationship that is, you know, this is the end of a relationship. It's the end of a commitment, and it doesn't have to be. It could be with anybody. It could be with a. I mean, we have a child when we have somebody that's middle-aged you know we could we you know I don't know what it is it could be um, it could be partners it could be partners it could, it could be between people that work together it could be somebody losing a job or they don't have a job it's definitely somebody doesn't they could be becoming unemployed or they are, or they are unemployed or they just are not qualified the ten of cups reverse is a family situation or a relationship situation that is uh, Obviously, it's not stable, it's not secure, and it's not emotionally fulfilling. And it's the end of it. You know, if it's not emotionally fulfilling, if it's not stable and it's not secure, and somebody's not getting what they deserve, then why would you stay in that predicament where there's so much pain? You know, best thing to do would be to walk away and clean up the mess and build a new foundation someplace else. So that's what we have here. And it is heartbreaking, but that's what needs to happen. It's time. It's time to be happy. And if it means walking away, then it means walking away. Whether it's from a relationship or a job or a friendship or whatever it is. Peace is more important than fighting. We definitely have the end of a partnership. There is going to be a separation because there's no compatibility. There's no harmony. There's no working together and and it's there's one-sidedness one person is not qualified they're lazy they're unfaithful they're unrealistic One more card. The devil. I could be dealing with a Capricorn. I'm not sure. The devil is somebody that is in their shadow. They're in a deep, dark place. They are unhealthy. They are toxic. Or the, and it doesn't have to be a Capricorn. This is somebody that is in a... You think about the devil. Devil don't bring anything good. Maybe for a minute. But not for very long. I feel like we have somebody that it needs to break free. From a toxic, unhealthy situation, whether it's an addiction or a codependency or um, 
materialism, or it could be anything. But whatever it is, it's, it's uh, not healthy. Somebody needs to break free from a healthy situation or unhealthy situation that is not bringing them happiness. It may, you know, the shadow is not all that it looks like, right? It may look like it's happy or it may look like it's okay, but below the surface it's not. Somebody is tied to a situation. They are obsessed with something. They're trying to force something. They're probably angry. They're in their ego and they need to break free. And we do have the end of some sort of relationship here. It's just not a healthy place. Good luck.